Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode of the Lap of Luxury Reviews. Today we are here at Some Big Wheels Ashok Vihar New Delhi to present you an up close and personal in depth review of the BMW Z4 which they have in their inventory. So without further ado, let's begin this review. So this is the front of the BMW Z4. You can see the iconic BMW kidney grills. These are the bi-xenon headlamps below which is the headlight washer and parking sensors. These are the standard alloy wheels, the 18 inch high performance alloy wheels by BMW, which are standard on the Z4. Does have a BMW logo and S drive 35i badging on the side fender. The fuel gate. Let's see the side profile of this vehicle. Very impressive. Let's move towards the rear part. This is how the rear of the Z4 looks. It does have a very stylish Z4 badging. These are the LED tail lamps. It does come with rear parking sensors and dual exhaust pipes. This is the hardtop convertible roof of the Z4. Let's see the interior from the outside. A very long hood. Now let's see what it has to offer. Under the hood is BMW's 2979cc engine, producing 306 horsepower and 400 newton meters of torque. This does 0 to 100 in quick 5.1 seconds. In India, Z4 comes with only this engine option, which is a petrol. Now let's check out the interior. This is the driver's door of the Z4, stitched in red leather. These are the controls for the side mirrors. All four windows are naturally fully automatic. Now let's see how the dash looks. Does have red leather seats. This is the key of the Z4 to start the vehicle. Put the key in the slot. Put your foot on the brake and push the button to start. The instrument cluster. Let's rev it up. Makes amazing sound. The steering wheels come wrapped in leather with two paddle shifters. These are the controls mounted on the steering wheel to move up and down. The CD changer, volume voiceover, call. Very nice steering wheel. This is the instrument cluster. Controls for the headlamps thus come with rear fog lamps. This is the main iDrive infotainment screen of the BMW, below which you can see the controls for the hazards, lock and unlock, and controls to turn individual AC vents on and off. As I have dual zone climate control, you can set individual temperatures for both sides, fan speed, recycling, front and rear defrost, volume control, start stop button, controls of the indicators, Press this button to turn the parking sensors on. This vehicle doesn't have rear view camera, but does have parking sensors. The gear knob, which is very sporty, control for the traction control and drive modes. 
These are the controls for the iDrive system, CD, telephone, radio, navigation, the parking brake. This is how the passenger door looks, all stitched in red leather. This is an armrest, below which is the input of auxiliary and USB. Glove box with illumination. These are some menus of the address screen. You can control the screen with this rotary dial located here. You can move up and down, left and right like this. Very easy to use. Now let's see how this vehicle sounds. Illumination in the interior. The slot for the key. Now let's put the convertible hardtop roof on and let's see how it looks from the interior. The roof is back on as you can see. This is how the windows go down in the Z4. Very impressive. The view of the uh, the hardtop going on to its original position from the exterior. Very sporty vehicle. If you are interested in buying this vehicle, you can contact some big wheels. The details about the dealership is in our description box below. Feel free to contact them and check their inventory. If you are planning to buy a premium luxury car in the used pre-owned market, Contact some big wheels for best offers. We are very much thankful to this dealership to provide us with this vehicle. We would be soon posting more videos with the cars available in the stock. Thank you. Stay tuned to Lap of Luxury Reviews.